Hey guys, I'm hoping my signal is going to keep up. This will just be a quick short live, but I wanted to show you where we were today. If I can find my way around. Right, so today we've came to Dumfries House and the reason I'm not going to gatekeep this and I want everybody to know about it is because it's free. So obviously it's a school, ho well, it's a school holidays for us anyways, but this place, I don't know why I have never been here before. It's an hour away from my hometown and it's like amazing, absolutely amazing. Like I can imagine how amazing this is in the summer as well. I'm feeling it quite chilly today, but aye, I'm going to show you a wee quick wonder. So it's got loads of gardens to walk. You can actually explore the house itself. Engineering Centre, Woodlands Restaurant, Walled Garden, the Royal Drawing School. But not only has it got all these things, I, I swear to God, it is so beautiful. Like the full walk. I know you're getting glared from the sun, but that's the way we came in. It's got like a cafe restaurant over there. But I want to show you the park and stuff that's down here. So I'm walking on the outskirts of it just to show you. I'll show you when I get down there. But this is so good. It's, it's not cold here today. It feels like the start of winter. You still got that bit of sunshine. Um, and we thought, do you know what? We're going to come here because we've never been before. Yeah, you should pack for winter, Larissa. It's very cold. Um, we've never been here before and it's somewhere we've wanted to try out. But look at the likes of this. Look at them trees. I'm not somebody that appreciates nature the way we should, right? But they trees are something else. And it's got a big maze, but the maze isn't working. I'll show you anyways. But this year, honestly, if you're anywhere near uh, Dumfries House, you should definitely check it out. I'll, sh I'll post my pictures and stuff later. Let's go this way. Avoid the peoples. 10 minutes up the road from Newcomb, not yet. So in there's like a big maze, but that's closed today, unfortunately. And across this bridge, it goes into like a walled garden. It's got like the Chinese bridge, a big fountain, everything like that. There's loads of different walks up there with loads of different gardens to walk through. And then, it's, like, it's so good for all ages. Then you've got this. This was actually really scary. Isn't it beautiful though? Go to the house and see the tree. Which one? I don't know which one you're talking about. But look, even for big kids, Abby absolutely pooped herself going along, along this. There's one side there. It all connects. You can go across this bridge. This is a wobbly bridge. Kai liked to jump and scare us all. And then you've got another two sides there. But we'll go up here. Hopefully my signal will stay. I know the trees are absolutely massive. But this is free, it's free entry, so it's so good for families. And to be fair, like it's got a cafe there, which is reasonably priced considering they don't charge to get in. But you can bring a picnic. I've seen people sitting next to the trees with a picnic. Wish it was that organised. Hudson is loving it. So is Gian and Kat, yeah, that's what I mean. It's amazing for all ages. That's not me out of breath, I swear. Yeah, 
at the actual Dumfries house, walk towards the house, there's a huge tree you can sit on. Oh, I'll have to go and have a look. But like, here's like another park. My lot's up here somewhere. I was the first one down that side to zip lines, everything else. But how good is that? For a family day out, honestly, we've only seen half of it because we didn't come till late. But especially for summer, that'd be amazing. Yeah, our kids are off school. This is us on our first week of our October holidays. So we try and do as much as we can with the kids um, in the first week because they're obviously their dad's the second week. So yeah, we found this bit and I thought it was amazing. What's down here? Oh yeah, that's the cafe we went in. So we did have lunch when we came. I think the cafe shuts at half four and it's got like outdoor and indoor seating. But yeah, I thought I would show you it. Um, and then you've got something to do in this area, but it's been absolutely amazing. We've really enjoyed ourselves. Hudson's now going to try the zip line. I'm going to be a scaredy cat mum, as always. Oh, that's amazing, Nicola. But <coughs> I'll show you the rest later. Hopefully we've got to do our palette live. Um, depending on what time Rebecca Ralph falls asleep at. Go left towards the house, so I need to go that way. I'll try and find it. It shuts in 20 minutes, so we've not got long. Oh my God, Alecta. <laughs> yeah, isn't it beautiful? Oh no, here we go. Jen and Kay. <laughs> Careful, Hudson! Hudson running straight towards them. Fear of life into me, so I'm going to go just now. But look out for a post later. I'll show you some of the other bits that I've not been able to show you. That's the La Vista, baby.